Hello, welcome to the channel. I thought I would make this uh, video of the world's cheapest ACDC TIG welder that's capable of welding aluminum. A little backstory. This is the uh, Hitbox HBT250P ACDC TIG welder. Sells on Amazon on sale for $3.99 or the regular price is typically uh, $4.99. I've seen it on Amazon as cheap as $3.59. So, did a search for this welder and I found this one over here on Timu for $242, free shipping, $260 delivered. So I ordered that. What showed up was a welder that had been previously used. The uh, consumables were missing. It only had the stubby back cap and, and one cone. And it was missing the manual. It does have a little pass sticker on it uh, that it was inspected whether that is when it was new or before it was sent out I don't know so <clears throat> I reached out to the seller who is the manufacturer on Timu and this was also my first uh, Timu purchase so I was a little hesitant uh, one for the price uh, what I can say is for my first Timu purchase is so far so good. I reached out to them, explained the situation, sent some pictures of the torch, and this was all done in chat, right? Uh, I could have just clicked and returned the item, but uh, I decided to go this route. Um, definite time zone difference, because I'm probably talking to someone in China. So, uh, his response was great. I sent him some pictures. We agreed that this was a previously used welder. I did uh, plug it in. I haven't got an argon tank yet uh, to TIG weld, but I did plug it in and just uh, run a couple uh, beads with the uh, stick welder. It does seem to function. So, with that being said, the original discussion was, well, we'll send you a new consumable package and uh, with a new torch and, and accessories. And I was pretty good with that. Uh, I did also mention that, uh, you know, the welder had a dent in the side and all that. Uh, the company agreed to send me a new welder. So that is this. So my buddy James, if you're watching this, if this works out, you get yourself a free TIG welder. So I'm gonna unbox this real quick just to see if this one arrives in better shape than that one. So far, so good. The other box uh, did not have the original styrofoam. The torch was just loose in the box. This is a new torch with consumables. Long back cap. The stubby back cap. Very good. This is the ground clamp. The ground clamp on this is very short, so I'll, I'll be extending that. The TIG torch, on the other hand, 
is very long. Let me just set this out of the way. Next in the box is the uh, TIG Stinger. I've already actually used this on the other welder. Uh, it seems a good quality. It is a little on the short side, but not horrible. Here is the welder itself. Again, this one appears to be absolutely new in factory wrapping. This is the same hose I received with the other one. It does fit tight on the back barb. Uh, it comes with a couple hose clamps. This one actually came with the manual, the two hose clamps. And that's it. So what I would like to do is just say that if you see something on Timu that uh, appears to be too good to be true, uh, this is the same seller that I would have been communicating with if I would have received this welder, uh, previously used welder from Amazon. So as you can see, new box, uh, this company made it right. Um, I didn't do a return on the, on the other item. He agreed that this should have never been sent out as a new welder uh, and didn't want it back because he didn't want to risk it going out to another customer. So hats off to this company so far. Time will tell how good the welder is. But I did want to make this uh, video and give credit where credit is due. Thanks. Have a great day.